What's up my crypto legends? In today's episode, we are checking the BTC US dollar pair. It looks like that we are forming a diamond reversal pattern. I'm going to show you some different targets today. Also the Ethereum US dollar pair. I did mention yesterday, if we broke this green box around the $1,700 range, it would confirm this inverse shoulder head and shoulder breakout. Now I'm looking for the $2,000 range for the next coming days or weeks, guys. So I have entered a trade. If you're interested in trading, make sure to use the link in the description of Bybit. You can get up to $200 of bonus if you use my link. We'll be checking this chart from 2017. Also, Galaxy Digital Bitcoin ETF to launch this week as XEC eyes compelling opportunities and German private bank to offer cryptocurrency services. All of this in today's episode, guys. Make sure to smash up the like button and subscribe for coming updates and let's go straight into the content. Hello there, Andy here, and welcome back to another episode of Bitcoin Sensors, where you subscribe for the quickest technical analysis and news on Bitcoin, cryptocurrency, and the financial market. I'm not a financial advisor, so don't buy or sell anything that I say. And if you do so, do your own research and said this, let's go straight into the charts. All right, guys, by the time of recording, we all know that this inverse shoulder, head and shoulder, looks like it might be playing out very, very soon. We've also got this ascending triangle right there. As you can see on the chart, we have multiple points here of the resistance and we have multiple points here at the support. So are we going to break out to the upside or to the downside? Well, in the short term, we are going to look at the 15 minute chart here and it looks like that we are creating this diamond reversal pattern. This is a reversal pattern, as the name says. And as you can see, this leg up from here would be the target from the breakout. We can say this is a consolidation phase and this would be a leg up or you could potentially say, this is the leg up from here. So let's just go with the short one. And from the breakout to the upside, this would take the Bitcoin price all the way to the $53,000 range. And this would also be breaking out the resistance here of this ascending triangle or this inverse shoulder head and shoulder pattern. So we can have a very explosive move if this goes to the upside. But if we break to the downside, this would mean that we would come back down and retest this support area of this ascending line as you can see this would be the ascending triangle as you can see here on the chart so if we break to the downside which is more likely in a diamond reversal pattern it is 60 percent of the time break to the downside but we are inside this bullish pattern also the inverse head and shoulder pattern so we could also break to the upside anything is possible i am sticking more to the bullish side because we have this break out of this descending wedge that happened in the last few weeks also, we are creating an inverse shoulder head and shoulder pattern. We are creating this ascending triangle. So, and we also almost at about 70% of the pattern here. Usually the patterns break out at 70, 80%. So they should be breaking out very, very soon. This could happen in between today and tomorrow. So stay tuned guys and look for a potential trade to the upside if we break the $52,000 range with a huge amount of volume. Let's take a look at the Ethereum US dollar pair. If you watched yesterday's video, you did know that this green box is the $1,700 area, which is major resistance. And we have broken out of it, as you can see here, major resistance and support in the past, like I mentioned on yesterday's video. We can also see this inverse shoulder head and shoulder pattern and we broke out from the neckline i did say that we could broke out not with a huge amount of volume but the best way to trade this would be another candle breaking the high to confirm the breakout and we did and we got above this green box area which is the 1700 dollars resistance and i told you if we break out nicely with a good candle and come back and retrace it i'll be entering a trade at the 1700 dollars range and i did on vibe guys and if you're interested in trading bitcoin or ethereum you want to use bybit it is one of the best if not the best leverage trading platforms out there if you use my link in the description you can get up to 200 dollars to trade with guys so this is the update that i got for the ethereum us dollar pair remember that we did break out from this descending wedge here as you can see on the chart which is extremely bullish also this inverse shoulder head and shoulder pattern and they both target the two thousand dollar range the descending wedge should be about two thousand dollars and also the inverse shoulder head and shoulder pattern from the head to the neckline and the breakout 
should also take us to the $2,000 area, guys. So I do not see the Ethereum price just collapsing and coming to retest the $1,400 range. It is looking extremely bullish. We've got two bullish patterns that indicate we should be looking at the $2,000 range in the next few days or potentially couple of weeks. And let's take a look at this chart. This is the daily Bitcoin chart of 2017. As you can see, March is here of 2017 and early 2018 right here where we just peaked at almost $20,000. We broke all time highs four times in this bull run as you can see from the late 2014 all time high which was about $1,200. We can see we broke all time high and we did 122% pump and then we broke this other all time high and we did a 65% pump, and then the next all-time high, a 59% pump, and then the last one, when we broke the last all-time high, we did a 153% pump, going all the way to almost $20,000. We have only broken twice all-time high this time in this bull run. So how many times are we going to break all-time high and have a significant pump? Is it going to be two times, three times? Let me know in the comment section your price predictions. Will it be $90,000 per Bitcoin, $150,000? Let me know, guys, in the comment section. Let's take a look at this ETF news. Galaxy Digital Bitcoin ETF to launch this week as XSEC eyes compelling opportunities. The latest Bitcoin ETF to hit the market comes as the United States is yet to approve any homegrown competitors. Bitcoin exchange traded funds continue to multiply as a new entrant hits the Canadian markets on March 9th. In a press release on Monday, Galaxy Digital Capital Management, a subsidiary of financial services and investment management company Galaxy Digital, confirmed that the CI Galaxy Bitcoin ETF would likely start trading this week. Purpose ETF gets major competitor. The launch will see Galaxy join the TSX Purpose Bitcoin ETF as one of the pioneering ETF products in North America, with United States regulators yet to approve a single application. Purpose has seen a huge interest and associated volumes since the ETF went live last month around the same time that Galaxy filled with regulators. We believe the emerging digital asset class presents compelling growth and diversification opportunities. Steve Kerr's partner and head of asset management at GDAM, which will executive trading for the Galaxy product. The CI Galaxy Bitcoin ETF offers a simple and secure access point for traditional investors to gain exposure to Bitcoin. More ETFs coming into the game so investors have easy exposure to Bitcoin. They do not have to buy the cryptocurrency and store it in a wallet. They can just buy the ETF, just buy it like a stock. I think it's the TSX Purpose Bitcoin ETF. One of the ETFs in Canada has over 11,000 Bitcoin. This is how the demand is growing every single week, guys. Let's take a look at this German private bank to offer cryptocurrency service. The private bank is also investigating tokenization of assets it announced Sunday. Donna and Ruschel, a Hamburg headquarters private bank, is to offer cryptocurrency buying and custody to its clients. According to the institution, the decision to move forward with the launch planned as soon as possible was prompted by a high market demand for digital asset custody. DLC Distributed Ledger Consulting GmbH has been brought in a consultant partner for the bank's new direction. Donna and Ruschel next plan to intensively address tokenization of assets to maximize its chance of benefiting from an anticipated shift in the financial industry. We have been observing the digital asset market for some time now and we are convinced of the potential of blockchain technology also with regards to traditional securities transactions. Donna and Ruschel was established in 1798 and holds around 9 billion euros in assets under management. And look how they are urging as soon as possible possible to get exposure to these cryptocurrency services. They can gain a lot of commissions and also if they're holding Bitcoin or Ethereum in the long term, they are going to win a lot. So they are rushing to get into the game. Guys, this is going to be it for today's episode. Make sure to check out the Bitcoin Census website if you're new to Bitcoin and cryptocurrency. We've got great tutorials and guides on how to buy, how to store and how to trade Bitcoin safely. We've got price predictions. We've got the latest news and technical analysis. So make sure to check out the Bitcoin Census website. The link is in the description. And if you haven't seen my Bybit Leverage Trading Platform, a video popping up on your screen. A massive thank you for tuning in, guys. And I will see you in the next one.